Welcome to the Canoe Centre Show. On today's episode, I discuss our top recommendations for stocking filler ideas for Christmas 2020. Backed by popular demand, we have a limited run of the Irish Whitewater Guidebook uh, in all of its glory. Originally printed and made in 1995 with a remake and a new edition in 2004, we have the brand new printed version of the 2004 edition with all of its important facts and features and information that you're going to need when running rivers in Ireland. Also in the book lineup we have Ilan, this being a guidebook to the, all of the islands around Ireland, whether they be coastal areas and you name it, there's information on it, historical stories and a great great read for anyone that's interested. The go-to rule when you're carrying a rope or some cordage with you on the, the water is that you're supposed to bring a knife with you in the event that you need to cut the rope. And a nice example of a rescue knife being by Adelrid here uh, with their stainless steel uh, fixed knife. It has a nice sheet as well to go with it so you can keep it locked away for safety. And options, you can put it in your point seat or there's a mounting clip on the back of it as well so you can attach it to the outside should you want it there for a quick access. Maybe a bit ambitious on the size of a stocking, but some dry bags by Watershed and Sea Line um, are another great option for a, a gift this Christmas. The Watershed being ideal for whitewater paddlers or any paddler in general, ultimately a very bomb proof dry bag. But if for a sea kayaker specific, there is a tapered bulkhead dry bags. So the idea of this being that it follows the shape of the bow of the boat. So when you load your dry bag up with your equipment and clothes, it'll fill the inside of the boat and there's no empty spaces left behind. So for dryness and value for money, these are fantastic bits of gear. After a while, every paddler starts to realize that their equipment is getting well used um, and it does at some point need the wash. Now you're supposed to wash them after every time you use them with fresh water, but if you find that it's get, starting to get smelly due to sweat and overuse, that sort of stuff, you can use a nice odor eliminator by Magnet here. Add this to fresh water, it'll give your equipment a good dunk and rinsing and then you'll hang it up to dry. The idea of the odor eliminator is that it uses equipment friendly chemicals to kill the bacteria that's causing the bad smells. So then you can have a, a fresh set of gear for the next time you're out in the water. Whoa. Uh, sticking with the theme of keeping clean and staying fresh, uh, we got a set a pack of dirt wipes here. So the difference between these wipes and others that are on the market is that these are eco-friendly and they're biodegradable. But most importantly, that they're pretty big. They're a foot by a foot in size, so quite substantial compared to other products. These are fantastic to throw in the boot of the car or in your, your, your bag when you're traveling about so that when you get off the water or something that you can use to clean yourself up or you can clean off the paddles and the dirt that's on your gear before you put it in the car to keep the car clean. Something you find that you'll always need or your paddler friend will always need is another car binder. You can, you can never really have enough of them if I'm honest. Uh, this one conveniently comes in green or black so you can match it with the rest of your gear um, and just one of the things you're always going to need. With winter paddling well underway at this point, a nice safety product that you could uh, think of for yourself or another person is a, a good set of quality earplugs, for example, the one by Northcore or Surf Ears. Uh, the idea of these is to prevent cold water ingress into your ear canal and then prevent potential health problems in the long term. There's plenty of research gone into problems that can occur when cold water gets into the ear canal. So the easiest thing to do is prevent it getting in in the first place. And last but not least, a few items from our good friends over at Doerstone. The first one being their woolly bobble beanie, a nice few colours options in that as well. Uh, and following on with the bamboo polarised sunglasses that they do have, again a few colour options available. With the polarised sunglasses comes a nice uh, case as well for it, and a pouch for the uh, for the glasses themselves, should you want to take them on, on the road with you. All the products you see today, you can find them on the website, canucenter.ie or you can check them out on Facebook, Instagram. If you still don't know and you're unsure, just give us a call and uh, we can sort you out from there. So thanks for watching and good luck.